All right, maybe you guys can help me pick. All right, we have Miss Kim Kardashian, we have Carrie Underwood, very good legs, and then some lady on the cover of US, I don't even know who she is, humiliated by her husband. Yeah, let's not use that one. Okay, so we've got Kim and Carrie. Mm. All right, let's pick Carrie because her legs are spectacular. I want you to flex your feet and I want you to lift your bum up. You are going to extend those legs. Oh no, it's ripping. So that didn't work. Make sure to tape your magazine down or use a paper plate. That was such a fail. All right, now that that's all figured out, hands by your sides. I want you to place your heels onto that magazine. Flex the feet. Lift your booty up as high as you can. Make sure those hip bones are nice and in line, okay? I want you guys to reach the legs out straight, but see how my butt is still off the floor? And then you're gonna pull it right back in, okay? You're gonna exhale out and inhale in. You're gonna exhale out and inhale in. I don't know how long this magazine is gonna survive. It's probably gonna be so dead by then. this. But either way, it's a really good hamstring workout. If you do have any gliders or bow slides or um, a paper plate, would probably actually work a lot better than this, but I wanted to use a magazine because I have so many and I wanted to put them to good use and I thought putting my heels on them would actually be some good use, except they're not holding up very well. Anyway, you're gonna lift up and down. Remember, that butt has to stay up if it's going down. That is way too easy, guys. This is Bikini Blaster 2, Blogilates style, so we gotta keep it intense because that is what the whole Blogilates community is about. We ain't doing no fake workouts, it's real. Let's go out and in. We just happen to look really pretty while we do it. Out and in, or really handsome for you uh, male posters out there. Good, squeeze that belly button. Come on, reach it out. Are the feet flexed? They better be flexed. Reach it, and pull it right in. A few more, give me three, and two, last one. And I want you to hold it out there. Hold it out, flex the feet. Five, four, three, two, and drop. Very nice. Okay, for the final move, I want you to go ahead and get right up. We're going back up. Now for the final move, I want you to grab those dumbbells again if you have them. If you don't, it's totally cool. And you're going to place them on your shoulders. Now this, I actually was going to save for a calf challenge at some point to some song that you probably really love, like, I don't know, One Direction. But we're going to add it at the end of this bikini blaster. I want you to tone up your calves. And we're gonna talk about calves, okay? I know you guys have a lot of questions about calves. I want your feet hip width apart, toes facing forward. Very important because we're actually gonna go through three different positionings for your feet. So I want you to lift off of the heels and come right back down. This is a regular calf raise. And now we're gonna turn it into a crazy calf raise. So I do not want you to touch your heels to the floor here. They must stay up at all times. Oh, no, don't touch that carpet, or that wood, or that concrete, or wherever you are. Stay up high. These are like pulses. Because why? Because we don't have time. We gotta go intense. We gotta be efficient. And why are we adding weights here? Because we's intense over here, like I said, and we do it for real. Up, up. If you can go heavier, do it. Normally when I'm in the gym, I have a barbell on my back, and I'm going crazy intense. Usually. I put on a song and I just go. I just go to my favorite song and before I know it, it's over and my legs are dying. I can feel it for the next two or three days and that's the kind of burn that I love. Do you guys like my type of burn too? Let me know in the comments below if you do. I don't think I'm the only one. It's like that sweet soreness. It's so good. Nice. Do you guys feel your calves yet? Oh, wait until we do a calf challenge. I got lots of things underneath my sleeves. The ones I'm not wearing. Good. Uh, and up, and lift, and lift. You guys doing okay? Oh, you're doing so good. You look really good. Keep going. Up, up, up. You're not touching that floor, are you? Because if you are, you are not feeling that burn that I'm feeling right now. And three, two, one. That was for the center of your calves. Now we're gonna go ahead and hit the outsides. So I want you to actually face your toes in. Okay, so now we look like we have feet problems. And you're gonna lift up, and down. Touch the carpet first, up and down, or the floor. Lift and lower. Just to get used to that move. Okay, now we're going pulse style. Lift it up, up. Ooh, and I am all wobbly. Now my sister and I did these moves while we were on the plane on the way to Australia, 
and our feet got totally bloated and I really wanted to work out but I couldn't. So the only thing that was kind of like, you know, people couldn't really tell that we were being weird workout freaks was calf raises, even though people still looked at us and thought we were really weird workout freaks. But it was okay, because my calves were nice and toned and my feet were a little less bloated for the duration of the trip. Up, up, lift, lift, lift so good. Who's feeling it? Tell me if you feel it. Ah, oh, yell if you do. I really wish I could hear all these yells from everywhere. It's so fun when you're in a live class with me, and I hope you guys do get to, I hope we all get to work out with each other one day. It'd be so much fun. It'd be like 10 times more intense. No, 80,000 times more intense. Up, up, up. It'd be so much more motivating, but you know what? Working out with you here on YouTube is super fun for me too. Up, up, and you can turn me on at any time of the day or night. Good, five, four, three, two, one. You guessed it, we're going with Feet pointed outwards. Ah, lift, 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 lift. Whew, so nice. My calves are gonna be burning for the next three days. But don't worry, if you don't feel it tomorrow, you might feel it the second day. Sometimes there's like a de delayed reaction. It's totally normal. Oh, and let's talk about this bulky calves issue. You guys have no idea how many times I get this email, hey Cassie, how do I make my calves less bulky? Um, is this fat on the back of my legs or is it muscle? Okay, seriously guys, don't worry. Your legs look great, I want you to work them. Doing moves like this will not really bulk them up unless you're doing it with like crazy weights, you're eating like tons of protein. This is building up the muscle in that area. The only way to reduce the fat wherever it is in your body, we have to overall melt the fat. So that means doing the cardio, doing that eating clean, okay? So I can't tell you how, you know, if it's fat underneath, like right by your calf, or is it a muscle? Because first of all, I don't see you. And second of all, if you're questioning it, maybe it is fat. So all I want you to do is work out hard, and trust me, you will see the results. Don't pinpoint these problems. Just work hard. Everything will find its way. You will find your way. Good. How about 10 more? 10, 9, 8, don't touch that floor. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold for 10 years, just kidding. Okay, drop, nice work, shake those legs out. All right, let's go ahead and stretch out our legs or else you're gonna be walking around like a weird like thriller monster for a while. So I want you to actually uh, dig your heel into the floor like you're a cowgirl or cowboy and you are just gonna walk it down. Walk it down, stretch out those legs, beautiful. Inhale through your nose, exhale and bring it right back up, other side. Hold down, dig it down, and walk it. I think this is very appropriate, seeing that we use Carrie Underwood as our magazine maiden for our heels. Very nice. And come all the way up. Let's get those quads, because we did a lot of jumping, a lot of lunging, and a lot of, uh, what else did we do? Okay, hold it all the way back. Heels to that butt. Good. Other side now. Right there. Ho, ho, ho. Beautiful. Okay, and I like to add this one just for fun because um, we are coming from the Pilates background here and it's very integrative yoga. So let's go ahead and do a dancer's pose. I think I've done a lot of pictures with these, but we've never done it on camera before. So, what I want you to do here for the dancer's pose. I want you to go ahead and grab onto your ankle, okay? Keep your eyes in one place. It's gonna be hard for me to look at you while I say this, but I'll try. And I want you to simply extend the arm, extend the leg, reach all the way up as high as you can, really getting that low back and getting that leg in there. Balance, five, four, three, two, and one. Drop it, very nice. I'm gonna do the other side now, so. Grab onto the angle, find your center. Inhale through your nose. Exhale, extend that arm. And hold it, hold it. Higher. Five, four, three, two. I wish I could take a picture of you right now. And down. Oh, 
I bet you looked amazing. Good job. I hope your legs are totally dying and totally on fire because that's the only gift I could possibly give you through the camera, the soreness. So let me know in the comments below whether or not you like that workout. I hope you did. Make sure to pair that with Bikini Blaster 1. And in just a bit, you'll actually be able to figure out how many calories this burns on weighttraining.com. Oh, did I say a secret? Yeah, it's not out yet, but I'll let you know and it will link and I'll tell you what to do in that description once it is live. So I'm really excited for that because you guys keep asking me, how many calories is this burn? How many calories is this burn? So I can finally be able to tell you by your weight, your height, your gender, and your age. So that would be really cool, but not yet. This is secret popster information. Let me know what workout you want to see next. Is it abs? Is it arms? Is it back for your bikini? What's the most important thing that you want to really show off? And I hope you don't say boobs because I do not have any boob workouts for you, okay? Stop asking me that. But we can tone up your chest, so we can talk about that later. Anyway, follow me on Tumblr, Pinterest, Instagram, now I just got Instagram, how exciting is that? Um, Facebook and my blog, blogilates.com, and I don't even know. If you just type in blogilates, you'll probably find everything. I'm really trying to try a little bit of everything and it's just kind of overwhelming me, but I do really like Instagram. That one's pretty fun. Oh, Twitter. Twitter. Follow me right here and I will actually tweet you back because I love uh, checking my Twitter first thing in the morning. So you might get a good morning from me. Anyway, this is a super long outro. I'll see you next Thursday for another Bikini Blaster 3 workout. We are going to hit it hard and I love you so much, guys. You guys really make my life and you make me really happy. So I hope you're really happy when you watch this video too and when you sweat and when you feel sore for the next three days. I hope you're thinking of me. All right. Alright guys, I'll see you later. Bye!